Good morning, WLC. It's Toby again. It's the 2nd of April, 9 o'clock in the morning. How are you all today? Not a bad day out there. Nice and bright. Um, it's going to be quite warm as well, apparently 13 degrees. So a good chance, good opportunity for you to go outside for a quick walk, okay, uh, just to get some exercise and some fresh air in. I've noticed over the last few days, um, I haven't been going out as much. Uh, I have gone for a walk uh, a couple of days back, and then yesterday I stopped. Um, I was a bit busy doing things inside the house. And then today I thought, you know, I haven't been for an exercise. I think I will go out for a walk later on today, get some music on, you know, listen to my favorite tunes while I walk and just, um, yeah, have some exercise. Otherwise, you know, if you're cooped up inside all the time, you're going to start feeling what we call cabin fever. What is cabin fever? Now, that's quite an interesting um, phenomenon, if you like. It's quite an interesting thing that happens to people who stay indoors all the time. You start getting depressed. You start feeling a little bit closed in. You can't breathe. You might feel claustrophobic. So you feel, you know, like there's only these four walls and you don't know how to sort, you know, handle yourself anymore. So it's really important that you try to find some time outside on a daily basis. Even if it's a short walk, 20 to 30 minute walk outside, you know, you might want to go out first thing in the morning when there's nobody about or later in the afternoon. Have a look outside and see, you know, when is it that people are outdoors? You might want to try to avoid the shops if that's what makes you feel comfortable. You know, at the end of the day, do try to go outside once a day just to get some exercise, get some fresh air and to get rid of this cabin fever. Okay, so that's my suggestion for the day. You know, um, try to see if you can get yourself outdoors and uh, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Okay. Uh, what I was also going to ask, uh, because these videos are on YouTube, maybe you could suggest things that you want me to talk about. So in the comments, why don't you say, you know, this is what I want you to talk about, Toby. And uh, we'll see if I can get any ideas together. Okay. So comments in the YouTube videos or in the Google Classroom. And uh, like I said, I'll see you again tomorrow morning. Take care now. Bye bye.